Hello and welcome to tutorial 24 in the Microsoft Visual Basic.net programming tutorials. In this tutorial we're going to simply learn how to send an email by connecting to the, the SNTP host of that email and then sending the email. So, first of all create a new project and we'll call it send email. Now for this I'm going to use the default Google Mail SMTP settings but if you don't know what the SMTP well, sorry, if you don't have a Gmail account, then find out the SMTP settings of your email host. So, I'll actually, I might include that in the description, the, some common ones. So, all you're going to need for this is a button. So, we're going to ch change the text to send email. Okay, now we're going to double click. And the first thing we need to do is type imports system.net.mail now it, it I'm, I'm I'm actually making a tutorial on well not a tutorial just an informational video on imports um pretty it's not too far down the line but it's going to be quite a while so I'm not actually going to explain what it, this means right now but it you should be able to understand it really but I'm going to make a video on that later but this video is just how to send an email. So first we need to declare our mail message by typing dim mail as new mail message. Now we have our mail message we can type mail because this is the name here that we called it mail dot subject equals and now we're going to need to give it a subject we'll just call that test email then we're going to type mail dot to dot add and in brackets we're going to type your email at google mail dot com and then in mail dot from you going to you want to just type your email here too because you're just going to send the email to yourself from yourself sounds a bit pointless but it's just to show you how it works so here we'll just type your email at Google Google email dot com and then finally we need to type the body whoops what I've done wrong here oh sorry I've missed out something here mail the from equals new mail address and then the email in brackets sorry about that this is embarrassing okay so next we're going to type mail dot body and here is going to be the body of the email so we'll just type this is an ownage email using vb.net. Okay, so now we have our mail message set up. We're going to need to configure our SMTP client. So, first of all, if you don't if you don't know what SMTP is, I'm not going to explain it to you. It's just a way to connect to your email, and we're going to use the SMTP to connect to your email server. And I'm going to give you the Google Mail SMTP settings. And if you don't know, so if you're using Hotmail, for example, just Google a SMTP host and port for Hotmail and use that. But if if you using Gmail, just follow along. So first, as we did with the mail, we're going to declare SMTP as new SMT SMTP client, and then in brackets and quotations you're going to type the client so for google mail it's smtp.gmail.com i'm pretty sure it is anyway I, I haven't actually double checked but that's what i think it is and now smtp.enable ssl equals true whoops too many l's then we're going to type smtp.credentials and here this is just going to be your login username and password I'm not going to type mine for obvious reasons but type yours where I'll show you now actually where to so we'll type new new whoops new system dot net dot network credential and then in brackets first of all in quotations here we'll have username and then a comma and then in the second pair of quotations we'll have the password so then let's go to the next line smtp dot port equals and it I, I'm pretty sure it's five eight seven again I'm not sure I haven't double checked sorry I probably should have but if you're not sure if it, if it doesn't work then just double check the settings for Gmail 
and then next line simply type smtp.send and in brackets mail because that's what we declared up here so let's just go over this first of all we're declaring mail as a new mail message and then the properties of the subject of the mail is going to be the test email the mail is going to be sent to your email the mail is going to be from your email a mail body is going to be here and then the SMTP client well first of all we're going to declare the SMTP as a SMTP client and this is the host and then we're going to enable SSL we're going to we'll, we're going to configure our credentials here which are username and password so please just replace this with like your email at googlemail.com and then just put your password in the second one and then for this we're just configuring the port of the SMTP which is 587 for Gmail and then finally at the end we're going to send the mail so I th and there's not much else I can say about this but that's the easiest way to send an email in Microsoft Visual Basic .net. and if you have any questions about this then please leave a comment and I'll answer right away if you have any suggestions or requests then leave a comment too and please rate the video and subscribe thanks